Ditched mattresses and overflowing dumpsters, they are some big problems, according to neighbors in Colerain Township, who say littering and illegal dumping are being overlooked. Reporter Marielle Carbone takes a look into the issue and how the township says it is now responding. It's hard to see. Right now, Colerain Township is blanketed in snow, but beneath today's white cover is a problem neighbors say is easily seen every day. Anything from a dirty baby diaper to literally sacks of garbage or a sofa. Stephanie Wright lives in the township and says littering and illegal dumping are issues. She's been driving around snapping these photos. A dump sofa, appliances, Overflowing dumpsters at businesses and trash piled up at donation bins. With garbage, once you see it, you can't stop seeing it. She's reported it all, trying to get the township to take action. And even helped take out a billboard last fall that looked like this. Had enough. Stop trashing our community. My call to action is, is if you have time to put a post of a picture of, of some litter on, on Facebook, you've got time to pick up litter. And Township so, Administrator Jeff Mills agrees it's an issue, but says it's not unique to Colerain. He also says the township is working on it. In fact, it's one of the township's top six priorities for 2021. Of the township with a focus on litter and dumping. And to do that, it's hired two maintenance cool. employees who will specifically pick up trash along roadways, as well as a police officer dedicated to environmental crimes. As for those donation boxes... We're working right now on a, on a, uh, a registration program for donation boxes so that it just establishes a person to call. Both Mills and Wright agree the responsibility doesn't fall on one party. It's all of our responsibilities. And say it's up to everybody to do their part. We have what we have and we need to take care of it. And Mill says that the township is seeing success with some of its work. In fact, the vacant lot I'm standing at right now where the Kroger used to be was seeing a lot of illegal dumping. But he says after working with the property owner, they are seeing a significant cutback in that happening. Reporting in Colerain Township, I'm Marielle Carbone, WCPO 9 News.